Hello. Welcome to our Fiber Database Administrator Training, covering the topics presented at IB Experts Firebird School, held by Holger Klemt and Jason Chapman as part of the International Firebird Conference 2007. We'll continue in this session by taking a brief look at the Fiber Database pages. When you create a new database, be it single or multiple file, a number of things happen. The database files are created. The header page is formatted and written. The various system tables, RDB dollar and MON dollar, and associated indices are created and appropriate pages formatted and written to disk. Every page in the database is formatted with a defined data type. When a database is created, the DBA can specify the page size or leave it to default. This action creates a database file or files with enough space allocated to create all the system tables and indices. New pages will be added to the end of the database file as and when the user creates new tables and or indices. For example, a brand new database created on a 32-bit Linux system with a 4 kilobyte page size allocates a total of 0 times A1 pages, 161 pages for the system tables, indices and the various database overhead pages. The first page in the database is always a header page which holds details about the database itself the page size and so on. The second page in the database is a page inventory page or PIP, PIP, which details which pages in the database are in use and which are free. Up until Firebird 3.0, the next page is a write ahead log page, but this page is wasted space if present and will most likely be dropped from Firebird 3 onwards. The remaining pages consist of index root pages, transaction inventory pages or TIP, pointer pages, index B tree pages, data pages and so on. There is a discussion of each page type in Norman Dunbar's documentation which can be found on our website. So what is the primary pointer page? A pointer page is used internally to hold a list of all, or as many as will fit on one pointer page, data pages that make up a single table. Large tables may have more than one pointer page, but every table, system or user, will have a minimum of one pointer page. For the category table, the primary pointer page number is 142. It starts at the byte which equals page number 142 times 16 kilobyte, which is the page size. This contains basic information concerning the location of the data pages for this table, like a table of contents. The same applies for the index root page, which stores the location of the indices for this table. Every table in the database has an index root page, which holds data that describes the indices for that table. Even tables that have no indices defined have an index root page. The average data record length is displayed here. If you have, for example, a DBase table with two fields, each defined as a char 100, the average data set length is 200. Firebird, however, doesn't store strings of empty characters. It stores one empty character multiplied by the number of times it occurs. This is the reason why data imported from another database is sometimes smaller in size after the import. Total records shows how many data sets there are in this table. The average version length displays how long the record versions are on average. For example, if I perform an update, it shows here how many bytes on average were altered in comparison to the original dataset. Total versions shows how many versions currently exist for this table. Max versions shows the maximum number of versions for one data record. Data pages. How many data pages are used to store the data for this table? A data page belongs exclusively to a single table. The page starts off, as usual, with the standard page header and is followed by an array of pairs of unsigned 2-byte values representing the table of contents for this page. This array fills from the top of the page, lowest address increasing, while the actual data it points to is stored on the page and fills from the bottom of the page, highest address descending. Average fill. How many data pages are filled on average for M%? Fill distribution. How many pages have a specific fill percentage? We'll look at these last two points on a larger table, the customer table. In the customer table, we can see the following fill distribution. Zero pages are filled 0 to 19%. One page is filled 20 to 39%. This is most probably the last page. And 164 pages are filled 80 to 99%. The average page fill is 90%. 
The Firebird server normally fills data pages up to 80% and not more. It retains some space in case an update is performed on one of the datasets. Then it can file these revised record versions on the same data page. This saves having to load multiple pages when calling up a dataset with numerous record versions. This, however, means that a new database with newly inserted data is never filled to 100%. As we said, in 99% of all cases, it is filled to around 80%. Older tables will have a lower average fill if there's a lot of inserts and deletes on them, although Fiber does reuse the space. A more concerning reason for a low average fill could be a badly chosen page size, where only one or two records fit onto a single page. The remaining space isn't sufficient to store a further record. Upping the page size could offer benefits here. If this feature is not required, the parameter Use All Space can be altered in GBAC or IB Expert when restoring the database. This is often required if the database is to be stored on a DVD or any read-only database where no data manipulation is expected. All Firebird pages are documented in detail on our website. Go to www.ibexpert.com and search Firebird Internals to read Norman Dunbar's great article. So that was our introduction to Firebird database pages. A transcript of this tutorial can be downloaded by all IB Expert registered full version holders from the customer download area at www.ibexpert.com. We hope this tutorial has been of help to you and look forward to publishing the next topic in our series for database administrators. Goodbye for now and thank you from all of us at IB Expert. <laughs>